What is up, guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today, we are tackling the Mystery Grand Prix, the creator series. I do need to preface this video. Um, I apologize in advance if I drive bad. I've done four hours of iRacing, Bathurst 12 hour today, and I'm already a little bit knackered. But we'll see how we get on. Let's see what the track is and if we can get back in the championship fight. Also, side note, it's my 50th race in creator series. <laughs> Woo! Hopefully it's not cursed. That's all I ask. All right, so ladies. Do we have any uh, spicy uh, things uh, happening while, while I was gone? Any uh, rivalries? Well, Anybody? Uh, Jake put his finger up his bum. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, that's, uh, that happened before I was gone as well, so... <laughs> it's not really news, but thank you for letting me know. Amazing. If you've got no wing, get off the track. It's a good thing we went on a lap, but come on. What, do we retire? Um, Wait, is this is, it? Is this is it? it? Are we not retiring this or anything? Is, 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 is this practice two? Practice two? Yes, yes but this is practice. You should put 100 kilos in the car. Sweet. It's time to go and get into this pole. Chat, we need to go again. So we go again. We've prepared for this. Oh, that was close! Three tenths, that might be safety. I tell you what, chat! <laughs> We're through. We dodge a bullet into the 14s! Oh, I didn't, I didn't need to do another lap, for fuck's yeah, sake. Yeah, no, you, you were literally <laughs> safe by like two tenths. Damn it! <laughs> no, but if, if Dirk had the bottle, though, you, you may have been out. Yeah, so no, if Dirk had the bottle, you genuinely would have been at risk. So okay. It was, it was, it was good. I'm just surprised you were able to go again. <sighs> yeah, I overfueled, so I was, I was, um, oh, okay. I was buffing. Oh, my God. Why is everyone so sweaty? Can we check that, like, Yana Watmir is, or Brendan Lee is a racing for Nagura right now? Check his oh, files. Um, Bro's on a Logitech wheel, and he's this quick. That Q3 tie, if you don't make it into Q3 in a 100% race, I think in a 100% race, if you if you get knocked out in Q2 or Q1, you get that Q3 set for the race. Fact. Fourth gear feels like there's more traction. Come on! This is actually a good lap on used tires. It's not enough. It's P10. It's not enough. Or maybe it is the perfect position. P11. P11 kind of would be perfect. Or P10, I don't mind. Good lap, considering how used the tyres are. We are now P11, so if we want to make it into Q3, we need to decide if we want to burn up our tyres. I wouldn't be so strict on using new tyres if we had the option to select used tyres to start the race. What I don't want is to be stranded on, uh, let's say, a late race scenario. Safety car, 15, 20 laps to go. We put on, and let's let's say we've already used our softs because the game forces you to use your newest set. We're then trapped on like four, five percent softs versus everyone else on so on brand new softs. That's where we could. That's where that's like race costing stuff right there. We have 30 seconds to decide. No, because some people will have got through on two minutes remaining. I, I'm comparing myself to the very front runners. Like the Razans, the Nagueras, the Skyzies who get through to Q3 on one set of tires. All right, chat saying go out, so we're gonna go out. We're gonna keep everyone happy. Oh, never mind. We're done, chat. I can't believe. I can't believe the times. Yeah, it is ridiculous. Closest qualifying ever. We didn't even have this in Austria. Oh my god! <laughs> Why is everyone so good? <laughs> <laughs> just, just to confirm, is that strategic last position? A strategic uh, bottom of Q2 position. I'm cooking, oh, just you wait. Oh my god. Wait. Look at all you guys burning up your softs. Oh, I'm going to be cooking in the race. Three tenths for the whole of the top ten is ridiculous. You know, I've got plenty of soft tires left. Good. <laughs> How many sets, Dale? Uh, oh, just correct. that Q3 set you get, mate, to be fair. No, but for the race. Uh, oh, oh yeah, for the no. race, I'll have none. Where are the point? Where are the points scored, Dale? Don't worry about me, Ben. I've got this covered. 
I've got this. Alex Gillum laying down the marker. 14-1. Safso beats it straight away. Let him cook! That is not too shabby. Can someone explain how old tires can go quicker than a fresh set? No way that was old. That that was genuinely old tires. Genuinely. Oh my god. Safso, you got some serious pace today. Check his files. All right, let's. Safso, here comes. Here comes Skyz. He's gonna ruin everyone's day. Let's see. Oh yeah, here let's we see. go. Let's oh, he's bowled a wide. Man. He's bowled a wide at the second last corner. Thirteen Skyzy seven. Here we come. too quick around Dimala. Hasn't had ten Old years to practice. Never. Ah! Oh, let's have some cook. Yo, I need for two rages, and you guys are correct. <laughs> what is this? Yeah, I'm on. I'm on like 18% wear at the moment. GB, you win. You win an F2 car, mate. <laughs> <laughs> two oh. seconds off your team, mate. I did two laps in Q1, mate. No, I'm not nibbling. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> He's on a race yeah. run right now. What does Safso do? Oh, Alex. Alex with 13-7. Uh, I like you, Saf. Oh, Strathing got a cook in this final nah, sector. he's not going to cook that much. P3. 13-9. No, Safso! <laughs> I like you, Saf. So, what about Neguera? El Rey still to go. El Rey still to go. 14-0. Wow. What a grid. A this is a crazy a grid, man. I'm thinking we start softs. Because I think there will be a safety car in the first stint. Then we go to mediums because the mediums are the better race tire. Um, and then we play it by ear for safety cars after that. I think there will be a safety car. There will be a safety car today, guys. There has to be. We have a fresh set of soft saves for later on in the race as well. Look at that. Three brand new sets of softs for this race. Told ya. Told you we were cooking. Uh, all right, chat, remember that strategy. That's what we're going to do. Oh, no. Oh, no. All right, medium, medium, soft it is. Or medium, soft, medium. All right, can we go medium, soft, medium, actually? Damn it! What tires are in on? Hards for Mitchy. Hards for GB. What are you doing? He knows that there's probably a safety car coming. To be honest, if there is a lap one safety car, I'm getting off these tires. No matter what. He loves gaming them, so watch out for him. <laughs> <laughs> you have had a chill time last two races, but I no longer... Not anymore! No longer, I will come on you in the... Whoa! Oh. 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 Yes. Ah! It's happening. Oh, like what do you mean? Bro, bro, bro goes on holiday. It's Just happening. Oh, chocolate, on. you're coming! He's, he's forgotten all the guys. What did you learn in San Francisco, mate? Good okay. luck, like everyone! Crashing around Bathurst. Jake got off to a flyer. Hello. Oh, I could have ruined Tom's day, but I chose not to. <laughs> my car where's my pace where the frick is my pace the car's just fine i'm not sure where my pace has gone playing on i racing today seems to have messed me up a bit it's fine we'll uh hold up our pace all laps we do more in the groove we should get Woo. 
GB got shafted a bit there. <clears throat> Maybe it's a confidence thing with the high speed corners. Oh. Because it's way different to uh, iRacing with the GT3s. Nowhere near enough high speed pace. Maybe that's where I'm losing out. But already a warning is a bit frustrating, especially when we're not quick. Build our confidence, build our pace. Let's get back in this race. Race is long. I smell an undercut to get us back in this. We don't undercut very often, but I think we might today. I'm just struggling to get going today. I don't know what it is. I'm still not making progress. Forget trying to uh, work with a race winner in Creator Series, a guy in the top four in the championship. Nah, just battle him, slow him down. Slow us both down. Let's finish P14. Sounds great, guys. Come on, I wanted to use some pace there, Rob. Nah, we haven't got the wrong setup on it. It's SRC. The only thing different this week is where, you know, we... We were racing on iRacing for four hours today, right up until just before the start of this lobby, so... Eh, karma. Oh, Fabio. Alright, big boy undercut time. Let's get me away from those people. Perfect job from you and the new set of tires reset we go again proactive chat we're being proactive cool let's make hay now others might respond yeah soft runners are in do we get drs Oh, I don't want to sit behind dark chocolate. Good job. That was the fastest lap of the race so far. Don't want to sit behind Dirk on hards. Yo, we can, uh, we can help each other more here, Ben and, uh, and Dave. Yeah, I agree. Okay, good work. Great work. Yes, let's go. Big boy undercut on a lot of drivers here. We're now getting dragged along by Jake on pressure tires. Let's go. This is all part of the game plan, guys. We had to change the scenery, change who we were racing, because those guys were not it. We're in better company now. I'll save the battery once we're more comfortably in this train. I save battery, I drop out of DRS. We've got bigger priorities right now. Jake is also out of battery and burning every lap to uh, stay with Naguera. We're just holding with Jake. Dave Gaming is quick. Might have to let him go. He's got fresher tires than I do. Look at that pace, that straight line speed. Smart call letting him go, he'll drag us along. Can't believe that straight line speed, that was nuts. Yeah, I know our fuel's not looking good. We're overfueled as well. If we're struggling, then others must be as well. Uh, no, that was unfortunate. Why the f is my Discord coming up twice? Everything is so scuffed today. 
Bad time to drop out of DRS. So slow today, it's outrageous. I'm resetting my wheel. Well, what happened? Let me know you're okay. Ha! <laughs> yeah, very good. Oh, very good. Bruh. Bruh. I. When I. When I. I, I here's what happens turn the wheel off. Turned it back on. We could press the back button to go back to racing. When I was racing, the wheel went straight. Wow. Jesus. What what a day. There's your safety car. <sighs> well, that's championship over. What a way to end our 50th race. You're welcome, everyone. There was a mudded race, and I have absolutely no explanation for why we were that slow. Right, I didn't sabotage Alex. If anything, I made his race. Alex is low on fuel, and now he gets to save fuel to make it to the end. You're welcome, Alex. Um, yeah, guys, I don't, I honestly don't know. I'm hearing Discord twice. People in Discord can't hear me. My wheel didn't turn when I turned. It's just, it's just a bit scuffed. Never do I racing. Never do I racing on the same day as Creator Series ever again. All right, we're off for the restart. A lot of penalties. A lot of penalties. You know, I, I would have thought that, like, because, because I could unpause the game like that when I reconnected my wheel, that I, that you would assume that I would be able to turn the wheel and use it. Even then, I paused the game to save myself. I wasn't lucky like Skyzy. AI threw me in the wall. The AI could not save itself. I wouldn't, I wouldn't say it's a wheel problem, no, because I, tur I manually turned off the wheel, turned it back on again while paused. You know, if, if Razen gets, you know, top three in this race, it was, it was gonna be GG anyway for the championship because we're missing next week. Who will win the race? Uh, you can't really bet against Alex Gillen. Alex has the best race management of pretty much everyone in Creator Series. Alex is going to put himself in a, in a position where he's going to have good tires, especially good battery. I mean, he's had a chance to save fuel now, so it wouldn't be wise to bet against him, I think. Oh, Elray. Elray up into the lead. Wow. Alex down to fourth. I bet he wasn't factoring in Sasso getting ahead of him. Is Alex all right? Jake was right in front of us when we when we died. Now he's fighting with the leaders. Just checking everyone's got new tires. Oh, what the tire ages for everyone. Oh, wow. Oh, people are on hards. Elray's on hards. Razan stayed out. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Alex and Razan. What have they done? Why didn't they box? A pit stop, a free pit stop on a safety car is worth so much. Bro. Jake might win this race. Razan, Alex. Oh, it's just Razan and Alex who stayed out. Razan and Alex are going to get gobbled by the whole field. Oh my word. He's in trouble. Alex, he's, he's done. He's gone full like Lewis Hamilton. Derby, Derby 2021. Stayed out. Bruh. Okay, this that completely changes the context of this race. Those hard runners are probably going to the end from here. The, even the mediums. The mediums can go to the end. I think Jake and Tom might win this race. Once the hards go above 25%, then the medium runners, even though they're above 25%, they'll be quicker than them for the rest of the race. That has spiced up this race. 
Maybe even this championship as well. This will be the first season I finish outside the top three. Yeah, Will. Yeah. We've had we've had crazy consistency in Crater Series. But, you know, missing... We're going to miss four races this season and have a stupid DNF in another. That is about half a season. This is an 11 race season. And we get no point in almost half the races. You're never going to finish on the top three with those odds. No one has said a word yet in uh, the VC since safety car. Oh my god. What is Alex playing out there? Oh, Alex has just missed out on DRS there as well. He'll be raging. Chat, I'm now the alternate commentary team for the rest of this race. If I had to put my money on, on anyone, it's the medium runners. I think, I think those medium runners are going to be flying for the rest of the race. GB might be on target for a good result here too. Maybe like a top five, maybe. Depends on how the hards hold on. Apart from Silverstone, I, I, yeah, this is the second longest pit lane on the whole calendar. You have to box under safety car at tracks like this. And this is the only safety car we'll probably get this race. I have no idea why Alex and Razan didn't box under that safety car. They have thrown their races away. I can't believe you guys didn't box. I followed Alex, man. I thought we would have been fine. Oh, shit. They are properly up a creek without a paddle, guys. Because, yeah, it's a green flag pit stop. It's like, like 27, 30 seconds transitional time in the pit lane. Are they, are they, they're, not, they're not coming back from that. They'll be fighting for 17th when they come out of the pit lane. They'll have a lot more pace, but everyone's going to stay out to the end, I think. They're going to have to put in some crazy laps. Otherwise, they are not getting points. They are falling in this race, and they need to do something. And they come. Oh, my God. Oh, it's Perya. Yeah, Sauce wasn't the play, mate. Sauce wasn't the play. Alex Gillen and Razan Chai will be fighting for one point in this race if there's no safety cars. We have mudded Alex Gillen. No, no, I'm not, I'm not saying that. He has muttered himself. He has muttered himself. Alex needs to respond. He does. Okay, this is going to be interesting. I, I, I'm kind of glad I'm watching. We get to see Razan and Alex potentially cut through the field. Razan is 36 seconds off the lead. And it's going to be quite quick. I don't know. If people like Dave Gaming, Dirk Chocolate, Chez make mistakes, they might, might come back into it. But... They're really not going to be fighting for that many points. Alex Gillen is in 18th place. With 15 laps to go. Alex is losing his head. All right, let's have a look. Let's have a look. We've got to see this. If your wing shouldn't be there, then I'll chop it off. You know, it's cost me my race. It's dumb. It's an aggressive dumb move, and you paid the price. His heart rate is at 120 when it's normally at 90. Yeah, he's angry. At least you're responsible for the Alex downfall. Saturday was not all bad. That's what. Oh! Skyzy! Skyzy is out! Another championship rival! Oh my word! Safety car. Alex is saved. Alex is back in this race. So is Raz and Chai. Skyzy in the mud. That could be GG for the championship. Congratulations, Raz and Chai, for the W. Skyzy was Razan's nearest competitor. And he's out. Tom was the next closest. He didn't turn up today. Then it's me. I'm out. So no matter what, Razan is looking rosy here. How has everyone bottled this championship? I know. I, I know. If only it was someone else in my place. But they will disconnect. Bro, we'd be cooking for the champion. No, no. Just no. Because Razan's going to fight back here. Everyone will box. Everyone will box now. Do not double bottle this, guys. Box. Good. JD Devil Noob leads the race on 20 lap old hards. Alex also boxes. They're back in the race. They're back in the race. I bet Alex is a bit more happy now. Maybe we should have stayed out. Maybe we should have risked it. But I just nah. don't want to be in the same situation. We're back in this race now, guys. But we're racing again. JD Devil Noob still leads this race. How has he frauded this? 20 lap old hards versus everyone on softs. 
Oh, and it's carnage. Look at all the people moving. They're three wide in front. It's going badly. And does uh, no. I couldn't get it stopped. Those brakes so hard. On the totem pole. El Ray into the lead. Tom needs to get him next. Straight away. Alex damage. Oh my god. Alex in the muds. Alex in the muds. Another safety car. Alex is so lucky. Alex is so lucky. What's the safety car for? Or maybe he's unlucky. I don't know. We'll find out. Absolute joke, man. Welcome. <sighs> Welcome. We're at the back. It's the strategy bot. We're still coming to bite me. It's the problem. Yeah. Welcome to racing at the back, Alex. This could actually turn into a strategy advantage for him. Luckily, a lot of people behind him are boxing. It's all on me, unfortunately. <sighs> Unlucky there, but... I Let's see what the tyres are that he's going to put on. We're going to be on older softs now, probably than most of the field. Okay, go, go, go. What are the tyres? Like Show us... Most of those guys take a wing change as well, so we actually don't lose too much there. Show us the tyres. Oh, he only loses uh, a couple of spots. I was going to box again for even fresher tyres, but... I don't want to lose these, what, five positions or something? Rise and damage too. Wow. Okay. Ben, you made this race more interesting. Safety cars breed safety cars. Creator series, you're yeah, welcome. This, is, uh, this has not been a good race by any means. Ben says podium, you got this. This has not been a good race by, uh, by my standards at all. Much like yourself, Ben. I mean, I picked the wrong tire at the start. Fair enough, hold my hands up for that. But the pace has been, uh, pace has been so off today. Come on, Tom, what do we never do? What do we never do? Exactly, exactly. Come on, Tom! We never give up, ladies and gents. And that is exactly what we're not going to do right here. It is seven laps to go. Okay, I think this is between El Rey and Jake now. Jake does so many five-lap lobbies. Eight-lap sprint to the end. Soft tires. This is this is Jake's domain. He needs to clear Tom. Um, El Rey will probably try and bolt away. We'll burn battery if Tom can stay with. While burning less battery, uh, Jake really needs to look after his battery too. He's not good on his uh, his ERS preservation. All right, we're going racing, ladies and gents. El Rey leads us off. We know El Rey loves a slow safety car. Restarts. This is to frustrate those behind. Look, look at that. Look at that. Front wings go clattering when El Rey does restarts. It's a... Uh, is the worst when you're a competitor in this race. But I tell you what, as, as a neutral watching, it is spicy. We're off for the final five laps of this mystery Grand Prix. And literally, with El Rey at the front, anything is possible, guys. Anything is possible. I can't believe I'm actually this happy. I'm genuinely, I'm, this is, I'm really enjoying this race. I'm so glad it's turned into a strategic masterclass. Oh, a strategic nightmare for the drivers. This is a race you made. Maybe I could clickbait the, the, the YouTube video with something like this. I made this race. Nah, that's a too long title. But you get the feeling. You get the gist. Alex is up to P11. I made Creator Series actually worth watching. That's, that's That sounds a bit depressing, to be honest. <laughs> I rigged this race. That Now we're talking. Rudy, big ups. That is a title. I rigged this race. Let's listen in on comms. I think it's going to be pretty quiet from here on out to the end of the race. Dale's out. It's a shame. Fortunately for Alex, he doesn't have to do too much to get track position back. He's abs He's kind of still nowhere. It's not been a good restart. I thought he would have made more progress than this. Up the inside of Vince. That's P10. Just shows you can have all the pace in the world. But when you're in the pack and have... You know, some compromising strategies or tires or whatever it might be can really put you to the sword. Alex looked untouchable at the start of the race. Oh, that's someone spun. Mitchie. And Mitchie doesn't have a penalty either. That's a big scalp for Alex. That is a big one. Oh my god. Very good. Sorry, Mitchie. At this stage, GB is on target for a podium. Really? Sasso's got to let GB go here. Sasso has surely got to let him go for the sake of the team. Let GB cook. Sasso's out of battery. Yeah, it's an orchestrated one. 
GB looking good for a podium. El Rey's managing this well. Let's have a look at his battery. 67%. Tom is 54. And Jake is... Oh, jeez. GG. El Rey is managing this beautifully. He's got the most battery. And he's the car in front. This gets complicated, though, if Tom gets ahead of him. He can use all of his battery once to defend against the Alpine. Once only. After that, he'll have no battery. He's got to use it wisely. Let's see. Does Tom go for the lead? Yes, he does. He makes it spicy. What about Jake? Too far away. Too far away for Jake. Tom now leads. <laughs> Heading on to the second last lap. I feel so bad for Tom having that penalty. Oh, ay, ay, ay. This is actually a very good position for El Rey to be in. He knows that Tom... Yep. He, he knows that Tom is going to try and bolt away for his sake to clear as many people as he can for the three-second penalty. And uh, he can just sit in the slipstream, get the DRS, heading on to the last lap, and uh, be under no threat from, from Tom or Jake. El Rey... Let's pull the blinder. Can Tom hold him up? No, it's not smart for his race. Tom wants to get a podium. Or something even better than that. Fabio's up to P13, P12. Oh, Razan. What's happened to Razan? So you want me to give up 10? <laughs> it's, your, it's your call. You don't have to, but... It's... it's okay, he's just... It's great. Cheers, Pajor. What has happened to Razan? Oh, he's having a stinker. Two points for Razan. He'll get three. Depends on how many penalties Fabio has. Razan ain't getting many points today. Oh my word. El Rey takes the lead of the Grand Prix. Heading on to the last lap. Jake will want to be aggressive, but he's out of battery. He is out of battery. There's nothing he can do about the win. El Rey's gonna gonna peace out. He's still got he's still got a bit of battery. Tom, they're all very equal on battery. But somehow Jake has the least. As always. GB's been dropped by DRS. Sasso's behind the P5. Leader of the penalty runners. Alex is... Wow, two and a half seconds off Dirk. Maybe Alex is older tires. Hasn't been able to make much progress. Perya is out. Not a good day for McLaren. Not a good day for McLaren. And yeah, that's Razan up to P12. P13. My words. Anyway, here we go. Soak it in, El Rey. He's going to get his second win in Creator Series. First of which coming in Zandvoort in a very controversial race. No controversy from El Rey today. A perfectly clean drive gets his second win in Creator Series. Good stuff there. Very good end. That was a good race. I really enjoyed that. Jake Oman P2. GB does get a podium. Alex Gillen frauds P6. Dirk Oman P7. Razan Chai, championship leader. It's a curse of the championship leader right now. They can't get a race together, no matter who it is. P11. What a race. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Sorry about the DNF. The wheel had other ideas. But in effect, our, our misfortune created an incredible race. With, uh, with Michi in <coughs> What a shame, though, that we weren't there to capitalize. It's ifs and buts. If we if we didn't have our shenanigans, it probably would have been a no safety car race. Razan and Alex would have been 1-2, and the championship lead would have been astronomical. Oh, who knows? Skies, he might have finished. Might have been in a different place to where Safso was. It's, it's just crazy. The amount of, like, one little domino effect sets off a chain reaction that creates one of the craziest races in Creator Series history. And that was my 50th race. Anniversaries, landmarks, they often never live up to the hype in F1. And that extends to the game. Thank you guys so much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. We'll see plenty more racing game content. Uh, next week, I'm off to Bahrain IRL. I will bring my laptop, but there's little incentive for me to sacrifice time on a very special weekend to do Creator Series. So 
I probably won't be there, but I'll be back for the finale of season five. Thanks for watching. See you in the finale.